Good morning ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the day of the video, Darren, how's it going today? Today, I'm just getting ready to go to work. I had uh, one of them days where I woke up at 10 to 6, my alarm goes off at 6. I woke up thinking that I, my oven was on, so I made sure they were all off, <laughs> and then went back to bed and I was so unbelievably tired that I just, I just set my alarms for an hour later, just couldn't do it. Um, I don't need to build up any flexi time today. My neck, man. Neck's gone a bit crick again though. Um, don't need to build up any flex time or anything like that today, so I'm just rolling in now. Well, to be fair, I'm leaving at about 10 past 8. I'll probably get there for about like 22, depending on the traffic, maybe even half past. Um, but yeah, so one of them days where I'm just too lazy, <laughs> I'm just like, I'm so tired. Uh, last night, I uh, cracked into the Easter egg Dad got me, which was like a, a pyramid of lots of tiny eggs. Um, yeah, I'll look, I'll show you. And I'm like, they all just fell out. I'm like, what the hell? Do I, I can't show you. Uh, what the hell do I do with these? <laughs> I can't eat them all. And it's just like, I can't put them back in the packaging or anything. So it's a good job I didn't bin my other Easter egg box because they're all in there now. Um, but yeah, watched Fargo. Fargo is still excellent. Um, and now I'm heading off to work. I think we've got planning today. Although they're trying to do this one hour long planning and it just doesn't work. But anyway, yeah, I've got things on my to do list to do today. Uh, I'm going to tennis tonight, hopefully. Um, it's going to be a relatively busy day. It's going to be relatively touch and go, to be honest with you. <sighs> but we'll see. We'll see how things go. <sighs> I feel like I'm just doing too much. <laughs> and I'm not doing... I'm doing too much, but I'm not doing the things that I want to do. You know what I mean? Like, there are things I want to do. Like, I wanted to get onto some video editing at some point this week, but I've just been too bloody busy. Today is the first day, though, that I'm parking... <laughs> um, my boss has given me his spot for two weeks because he's an oldie. Um... I'm parking his spot, which is good really, because I literally yesterday lost my other spot because um, I don't car share anymore. I was put on top of like the parking list because I used to car share, but now I don't car share. I was shimmied down that list and someone else gets it ahead of me. <sighs> but I've got this really like amazeballs spot for two weeks and then I have to go back down to with the plebs in the other car park, which to be fair, I can vlog and talk to you when I'm walking to work still, but yeah, hello. Right, phone, keys, camera, wallet, let's bounce. And I'm home, probably going to have to talk to you in a bit though. Um, because I've got a lot of stuff to do and I've got to do it all basically before 7 o'clock and yes it's 5 o'clock now but that's not the point is it I've got to have dinner relatively quickly got to finish eating it by like 6 and we've got to go and do some stuff out and about so I'll talk to you after dinner I'm going to cook myself a nice stir fry well ladies and gentlemen I don't mean to brag but I just put a new handle well grip on my uh, tennis racket look at that bad boy oh yeah it's, it's old look this Hear that? I'm not supposed to make that noise, but it does. Um, but it looks brand new, because it is new. It's got a new grip on. Tennis, yeah. My own duvet. Bam. Oh, yeah. Right, okay. Otherwise, it's uh, nearly 10 to ten to 7. I need to roll. Well, it's at half past 7, but I kind of want to get there early, just to see if I can talk to someone. I need to go to the bank first as well. So, right, let's make sure I know what I'm wearing. Right, heading on my way. Just been on the phone to Dad. Dad rung me literally as I left the house. Um, just got some money for tennis and whatnot. Turns out the beginner session, which is what I'm going to now, is more expensive than the friggin' advanced session. So hopefully I can get back on form <laughs> as soon as possible. Um, but yeah, it seems, according to the website, quite like open and stuff. I'm kind of nervous though. <laughs> I'm not very good at going to things for the first time. Um, Almost bottled out. I almost considered, oh, I could just wait till next week and I could just like do a drive by, see what it looks like, and then go next week. But no, just go, man. And just be awkwardly like hang around until someone says, hey, you for this? And I'm like, yeah. Wearing some hideously old clothes. Um, <laughs> these white shorts, don't know where I got these from. My new shoes, though. That's important. My new tennis racket handle. But a swimming t shirt that I've had for 10 years. Probably. I don't really have a, I don't have any sports stuff. I was looking through, like I went through about two years ago, didn't I? And I went and just threw away everything I didn't wear. And it's kind of a mistake, because all I've got left are basically all my best clothes. Um, I got rid of like all of the, the dodgy t-shirts I didn't like, um, with the exception of this, for some reason. So I was forced with either this or like a tighter, slim fitting t-shirt, which probably wouldn't suit. Um, but otherwise, we haven't really talked about today, have we? What's going on today? Not an awful lot. My computer was broken today. It's fixed now, but for some reason, the um, 
and I don't honestly have no idea why um, Visual Studio just decided to just not work it was just like mm, nah I'm not opening that solution no I'm not looking in uh, team team freaking foundation server no no I'm not I'm not even gonna do that I'm not even gonna open this file and I had to go through I repaired it repaired <laughs> repaired it using um, the inbuilt tools and it took two and a half hours to repair that's madness so I went and had lunch then went out with some of my team to go get a, a coffee from the coffee shop um, down at Cribs then went back still working on it I boggles the mind um, so today I've been reading the news I've uh, been watching some stuff on the old uh, uh, some political stuff but there's a party that lives near one of my teammates lives there is in one of my near one of my teammates and uh, they um, have some crazy parties uh, policies like crazy things like having an elected queen <laughs> who you vote for through stages similar to the x-factor <laughs> okay <laughs> it was crazy um, but yeah so we're almost here I'm nervous now <laughs> I have to meet people and talk to people aren't I? that's gross but yeah so um Otherwise, though, I did I did save the day a couple of times. I was mothering uh, deployments. Someone broke the build, and uh, I went through and we were just doing a demo. We realised the build was broken about ten minutes before the demo, um, so I had to backdate a deployment, which is the first time I've ever done that. That was good fun. Um, but then otherwise, yeah, that's literally about it. I did a couple of deployments. Lol. Oh, that was pretty good. That was actually really good. Um, talking to some people. It was actually really busy as well. There's like fifteen odd people there um obviously weather's nice isn't it so there's going to be more um but that was really good we did like some running around i'm all right that bit can do running about and then we had to do like rallies with um like quick rallies and stuff and it's <laughs> it pretty pretty exhausting like coming from swimming like <laughs> it's hard to tell if you're sweating when you're swimming you know what i mean but my lord that was hard work <laughs> and i'm like my hair is probably a mess. It's a good job it's dark. I'm going to go in and have a shower. But that was actually really good fun. Um, I am. It was a rusty racket session and I was pretty rusty. Um, my serve is miles out um, because it just is. It's just miles out. Uh, to be fair, I never used to have a good serve. But like, it's just hurting because I'm trying to do what I used to do. It's just hurting and I haven't used like my friggin' shoulder in a long time. I don't, I don't use shoulders. Swimming is why my shoulders used to be strong they're not anymore um but yeah so that was it was something else we did some serving and my my arm hurt um well we was doing like short court volleying and i'm terrible at short court volleying like i just can't take the power out of a swing it's always it's really hard for me not to go cross court as well i'm not very good at down the lines unless it's backhand i'm okay at backhand down the lines but forehand it's nearly always cross court and it's nearly always too powerful um it's either too powerful well i say too powerful it's either like right to the baseline or it's got no spin on it at all and it goes to the baseline because like you know what i mean i can only put power on when i'm spinning and vice versa um but otherwise yeah that was good uh, there's loads of people of loads of different ages as well um immediately started talking to someone called lip to lee who's joining as i am um he seems very much like me he comes from nottingham as well what's the chances um small world uh but yeah that was that was really really good really really good do need to get some practice back in i was unleashing my inner i used to be <laughs> shingy who's my old tennis coach um but yeah i was unleashing my inner him to as much potential as possible but then i think it's it's all it all comes down to the same thing that's wrong with swimming it all comes down to fitness it's just not there like i used to it's all about fast feet tennis and you can have like the most powerful swing in the world but if you can't get into the right position then you can't do it and i'm very much i never really practiced anything other than powerful cross courts and <laughs> or powerful down the line backhands um so that's why my game is very much like set in one way it's quite difficult for me to do other things but yeah i used to like every now and again i do like bad shots and i'll be like no concentrate it takes a lot of concentration but no concentrate you do this 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 swing there we go that was better do it again do it again and then i just lose concentration it's gone i've got to concentrate really freaking hard to do that yeah i'm trying to do all my different like sports and stuff um 
swimming is obviously my let's get fit tennis is my let's have a bit of fun and get a bit fit as well outside of the water <laughs> so i don't just use like the same muscles and stuff but yeah it was really good fun and uh, I, that was more or less what we used to do with shingy as well so um well the shingy was a lot more it was very much like just play with other people as opposed to there's a lot of us um shingy used to always do like he'd stand in the middle hit a couple and then do this 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 and that was his was more like here's how you do something now do it that was very much play and I'll come around and give you tips <laughs> which is a fine by me I guess because it's a rusty session it's not like a an actual lesson lesson so but yeah I used to love tennis and this reminded me how much I like tennis you remember when I went to Bath to watch the Lewis's play that reminded me how much I missed tennis because I used to play every week and the only reason I stopped is because I got a job that was literally the only reason I started working in a supermarket and naturally you work weekends <laughs> at the supermarkets because that's when they're busiest and so when you're part-time you just naturally work weekends and then that was when I used to go tennis so I just stopped as soon as I went swimming um, went to work <laughs> so but no that's good fun um, I'm gonna try and keep that up um, it's eight pound a go I was gonna join the member I was, was gonna be a member but while it is only £100, and I could twig it down to 50 if I was very, very cheeky. Um, <laughs> very cheeky. Uh, there's no much point in me doing that. Because that session is only cheaper by £2 if you pay the membership. And I'm only really going to be using it until, essentially, September. Because that's when I go to Bath. And then I'll be able to use the Bath Tennis Courts, join the Bath Tennis Club. Because I'll be on campus basically all day. Because... This is a far-reaching story, isn't it? Um, because next year, when I go back to university, for third year, final year, um, I'm treating it as much as possible like a nine-to-five. Um, we're still living in Bristol. Laura's finding a job in Bristol. We're living in Bristol because we're going to try and find a flat that we can, like, keep. So we'll pay through it through everything I've earned from this year, the amount I've saved, which is enough to last us quite a while, to be fair. Um, and her wages and then when I graduate I come back to Bristol and work because I've got a guaranteed graduate job well a graduate job here as well we then continue to work here in the same flat and then we just keep there and then theoretically if we can afford it on one of our salaries we can afford it on definitely afford it on both of our salaries and then we could just roll in money and literally just save and save and save and save and save until we pay for a wedding or a house that was a joke um, so yeah that's the plan there so, while I want to start going tennis and stuff, um, while I want to start going tennis, like in September, I'll be able to go to Bath, pay a hell of a lot less, and use free tennis courts. And there'll be people there, there'll be Lewis's in Bath, uh, and there'll be obviously everyone on my course. And then because I'm from Bristol, I'm going to want to commute to Bath early. I'm literally thinking of leaving like seven, if not earlier. Which, to be fair, now I leave at half past seven. And then I'm gonna to aim to leave at like four, depending on my lectures. If I don't have any lectures, then I won't go in. It's just a waste of petrol. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna treat it like that, kind of nine to five. But when I don't have work, I'll go, and then in the morning I'll go for a swim, or go play tennis, da 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 da. So what does that do? <laughs> Let's bring this right back around onto topic. And while 50 pounds or 100 pounds isn't that much for a year, it isn't a year's membership of being able to go and play tennis whenever you want is brilliant but i don't really have anyone yet that i can go play tennis with i'm going to try and like join the groups that they've got and see how often people go and see if i can make a friend or whatever um in which case it might be worth joining but if i'm only going to go to that session which is eight pounds instead of six pounds i'm not going to save 50 pounds or i'm not going to spend 50 pounds by paying eight pound once a week until september because there's a two pound price difference, um, there isn't gonna be like, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm not, there's not gonna be a hundred times that I go in order to make that 50 pound back. So there's no real point in paying that extra membership. But eight pound a week does seem expensive. <laughs> so we'll see. And it depends like if I ever wanna go on my own and not to that session. But I guess what I'm saying is in a really, really roundabout way, and this room is an absolute mess, I'm gonna clean it. Um, I'm not going to join to be a member unless there is someone that I can go and play with beforehand because I'm not bothered about lessons like I just want to go and 
do a bit of exercise, go and play with a couple of people, learn maybe a couple of different things, get into the swing a bit again before I go back to uni and get my ass kicked. Um, <laughs> so I'm not going to join the club unless, like as a member, unless the, um, unless I find someone I can play with on a regular basis or I really get into it again. Um, but I don't really see the point in doing that just until September because to be honest with you, like while it is a lot more fun, tennis than swimming, swimming is a lot cheaper. <laughs> well then again, if I was a member, it would be free, but I've got to then guarantee to go and play with someone else. You see what I mean? So I think if I get like, oh, let's do a little bit more fitness, I'll just go swimming instead of go tennis because tennis relies on other people. I've just waffled for a long time. I'm gonna have a shower and then I'll end the video, I think. Ugh. Right, I'm out of the shower, I'm gonna sort out my thingy. I was gonna do my neck. I was gonna have a shave, but I'm gonna, mm. I think I might wait one more day and then I can do it Saturday and turn Saturday into a filming day. Oh, I could do it now. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna end my video, render it out and have a shave and clean up. Have a, have a spruce around. That's gonna go soon. This is probably all dry. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cool, Friday tomorrow. Um, going to snooker after work. Aren't I busy recently? Oh, bloody hell. Right, thanks for watching ladies and gentlemen, and I will catch you. I think I've gone over everything that went on today. I'll catch you later.